Hi, I'm Stephen Simon, co-founder of the Spiritual Cinema Circle, and I'm very excited to share with you the previews for the movies for Volume 11. First of all, our feature this month is an extraordinary film called The Shift. This shift from the morning to the afternoon of your life, generally it's preceded by what we call a quantum moment. Directed by Michael Gorgian, who directed You Can Heal Your Life for the Spiritual Cinema Circle last year. David thinks that it's all BS. I don't think all of it is. I mean, we're, I'm, in, I'm entitled to my own opinion, right? Absolutely. You are entitled to your opinion, and I respect it. The extraordinary work of Dr. Wayne Dyer shot at a Silomar, where a group of people are trying to find certain lessons in their own life. I don't want kids. I know, I know. I didn't either. But this just happened, and I thought, I don't know, maybe it's time for change. Don't get to the end of your life and have to be able to say, what if my whole life has been wrong? I can't think of a greater tragedy than that. And it is a powerful movie about not letting your music die within you, whatever that might mean to each individual. There's a ship probably heading your way as well. Ha! Yeah. <laughs> That's all I need. That uh, could happen. Next up this month is the second episode of The Gift, our first Spiritual Cinema Circle original series, where we follow Eno and Ela on their journey to help humanity find what the real purpose of the gift that was planted here a hundred years ago was. Next up, pie and burger. Apple crumble it is. Coffee? Aye, aye. You want that warmed up? Well, I don't like cold gel. I meant the pie. I meant the conversation. Ouch. A funny, sentimental, and ultimately very touching and poignant film about a special stranger that winds up walking into a cafe at a very important time in the main character's life. Just got a little sidetracked. Time to be first again. Shine like you did when you were 16. It's a particularly poignant and beautiful film for the holidays. Mona Lisa, Mona Lisa, Finally, Tony's real. Les gens ne s'intéressent qu'aux apparences. Je suis né dans une prison dont on ne peut s'échapper, une prison appelée corps humain. Which brings back into focus the great question of what really is beauty? What is in the eye of the beholder? How do we judge people when they look a little differently than we think or perhaps society thinks they should be? So those are the films for Volume 11. We're very excited about them and we hope that you enjoy them.